Torkler over to Greenwood, already with one three tonight, and make it two. Six points for the conference rookie of the week, Jamal Greenwood. Setters in a zone, Jack Jones a three from the corner. Russell left alone in the corner for three, yes. Jordan Martin has entered tonight for the first time. Jones a three. <laughs> the freshman continues to impress from beyond the arc. He's got 15 tonight. And five points tonight. Weaver with the steal and lay in. Taylor cutting inside. Four points for the freshman Jalan Taylor off the bench. And Uskins comes up with a steal on Mickel. And lay in for two. That play igniting the crowd here at Nolan Gymnasium. Tim simply took it away and all alone for the lay in. St. Rose shooting 61% from the field, and a large part of that is right there. Jack Jones, 7 of 7 from beyond the arc, 27 points. This shooting display that Jack Jones has had tonight, you would think he'd be in the running for next week's award. Uskins with a 3. The 3-point shooting contagious. St. Rose as a team tonight. 12 of 16 from beyond the arc. Long rebound out to Martin. Ekstrom with the lay-in over Pearson. Here with tonight's play of the game, freshman Jack Jones. And really shooting performances don't get much better than this. 27 points, 7 of 7 from 3. You got to tell me, did you, did you wake up feeling pretty good today? You must have. <laughs> yeah, I mean, these games just happen every now and again. Uh, I don't know, I felt like I couldn't miss from three, so it was a good game. I mean, but it was great to see the team came to 54. Our goal was 50, but, I mean, team game. But shooting-wise, yeah, it's just kind of one of those days. <laughs> now, this is two straight games. Now you held New Haven to a pretty low total, the lowest in NCAA Eras, and then another low-scoring output tonight. So how have you seen this defense really pick up over the last two games? Well, really, everyone's just bought into what we were trying to achieve the whole way through. I mean, at the beginning of the season, we were known for our defense. We were locking teams down. We kind of got away from that a bit. And now we're really getting back to that. Last week against New Haven, we didn't score the ball well at all, but we shut them down. That's how we'll get the win. And if we keep playing games like this, there's not many teams that are going to top us. Now, three games left in the regular season. It starts this coming Saturday against LeMoyne in the Upstate Challenge. You guys can still get that home, play, that home playoff game in the first round. What will you guys need to do against LeMoyne and these last three regular season games to get up there and, and ch try to jump over New Haven in the standings? Well, LeMoyne, obviously, a good team. We lost them when we went over there. Uh, we just got to move the ball, play well, keep locking down on defense. We just got to work on staying in front, playing our game. If we can play the way we've been playing these past three games, I know we'll keep getting it done. Looking forward to it. A rivalry game on Valentine's Day. No love lost between the Dolphins and the Golden Knights. Jack Jones, player of the game, 27 points, 7 of 7 from 3, as St. Rose gets the win over Pace.